boom, it's a new video, and I'm gonna be quiet because I'm walking at the park, and my screen is dirty, and whoops, upskirt, no, okay. Um, <laughs> so once again, uh, I kept thinking about making a video and then just not, <laughs> but you know, I only have so many things happening in my life. So actually, um, if you didn't hear, uh, what, a, a week ago or so, I decided to try out um, Daily Motion from my videos, which is a very old website that has been around basically as long as YouTube, and I've always heard of it, and like, I've had people steal my videos and put it up on there before, so I've recorded those videos and stuff like that, but uh, yeah, so I was like, you know what, fine, I'll give it a try. So I made a new account. I, I read their, you know, terms of service and everything before I did, and just like YouTube, they were like... You know, we, we ban porn, but we allow non-sexual nudity for educational and activism purposes. Like, well, if, if rules are fair, that's what my stuff would count as. Um, <laughs> but anyway, so I made, a, I made a, cha a channel and I put, like, two videos up on it. And then, sure as clockwork, uh, as soon as I let people on Twitter and stuff know about it, suddenly my entire Daily Mission account got banned less than 24 hours after I made it. And, um, I was a little peeved. I don't know exactly why it bothered me as much as it did, because um, as we all know, I'm very used to being banned fucking everywhere. Um, but it just, it, you know, I've been saying like, oh, I'm not going to make any new content, blah, 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 for a long time. But I still have all this old stuff that I would like to be able to put up somewhere, because some of it's pretty good, I think. And I was like, well, fine, I'll just try it. Um, sure enough, <laughs> got banned. And it's just, yeah. But the next day... Um, oh, and that, that day after, you know, I got banned or I was like, I'm fucking done! I'm not gonna even bother with my old videos! I just give up, it's obviously never gonna work, blah blah blah. Um, but then the next day, instead of doing my usual Saturday livestream, I decided to look up some events and went to a drag, drag gun brunch. It was a little drag queen show in the middle of the- oh my gosh, there's another park over here! I had no idea, huh? Uh, I should probably head back before my dad is like, ah, there's- he's, he's watching the kids as the kids are on the playground, but- um, there's a lot of gnats around. It's very Florida right now. It's, uh, it was 84 when we got here. It's probably about 79 or 8 now. Um, it was 101 yesterday. It's going to be 105 next Saturday. Ah, <sighs> global warming. Anyway, um, in Portland. So I was all mad, and then I went to this drag show, and I just got all, like, you know, oh, I just really want to talk to people and record videos with them and hear their sides of things. And, oh, this was Juneteenth, by the way, too, the very first you know, officially recognized Juneteenth, and here I am watching a drag show with, you know, a good portion of people of color as the drag queens. <laughs> um, that awkward moment when you're walking past someone. <laughs> anyway. Yikes. Okay. Anyway, I'm not wearing a bra. <laughs> I didn't even, I just was like, it's hot, and now it's not. Hot or not. Anyway. Um, <sighs> yeah, so what else is new? Um, anyway, so I went to the thing and I was all like, oh man, you know, I just really want to make videos with people, whatever. So I was talking to them, I was getting excited, I, uh, exchanged info with a few of them. Unfortunately, about half of the performers there were, are from Seattle, <laughs> and we're only here for the weekend, so I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything physically, um, at the same time as them, but maybe for, you know, visual, video-wise or whatever, video chat-wise. Um, I set my dad up for a, for a video chat with his doctor today. Um, I mean, we made the appointment a couple weeks ago, but I set it up from today, and it's funny because he was, like, yelling into the camera. <laughs> like, Dad, just use a normal speaking voice. Ah, uh, old people. Um, but yeah, so anyway, um, and then today, <laughs> I, so my phone is broken. Uh, it's always been broken in that the USB transfer or whatever, my phone never recognizes a USB, and I've tried everything. Um, so today I just took the SIM card out, the, the, not the SIM card, well it all comes out, it's the little tray, um, took the micro SD out and put it in a little converter and put it straight on my computer, and actually it was really scary because it wasn't coming out, and then all of a sudden it flung out and disappeared, because I had a whole wall of shelves with our supplies and stuff like that in it, and it all disappeared, and I managed to find the tray and the SIM card and the micro SD card, but, like, these things are tiny and if you breathe on them they break. So it was a little, um, a little concerning, um, but I'm glad I found them. Uh, but yeah, anyway, so I was, I was backing up files or whatever, because I tend to do a lot of these videos like this, like I am right now on my phone, just because I have it in my hand and I'm out and doing things. 
And honestly, the, the quality's not that bad on my phone. Um, definitely a hell of a lot better than the days of having to use a firewire cord and record on actual tape and convert it all over and everything. And <laughs> so, um, one of my longtime followers, um, who is a really cool guy. Um, I always call him M rich. His name is actually Matthew, but I have too many Matthews in my life. Um, uh, he's this, he's a super cuddly looking black guy who loves Resident Evil. Like he's crazy about Resident Evil. And he just started watching my old gaming videos. And so he's like telling me like, oh, I love this part. This part was so funny, blah, blah, blah. And, <laughs> and he said like, but I don't understand why your videos are so short. The videos he's watching, are like over 10 years ago, they're 15 minutes each because that's what YouTube used to max out at. And even that you had to like, originally you had to have a certain amount of subscribers before they'd let you and everything like that. Uh, <laughs> and he thought they were short and it was just like, oh my goodness, how YouTube has changed. Uh, anyway, yep, I am coming back to the park. I'm gonna go make sure my dad is okay. And um, maybe do another video in the future because I actually have more I wanna say. I just. Uh, just don't want to leave my dad struggling. It looks like somebody's setting up for a birthday party. All right, bye.